Hi there. I welcome you to JPTS Broadcast on TikTok, on YouTube, and on Facebook. You are on to Coach John Efetobo. I am the Admission Processing Officer responsible for admissions across the 30 states of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, including Abuja, where you have JPTS present. Today I want to address this very important question. Lots and lots and lots of inquiries reach me on a daily basis. People are interested, people are curious from the north, from the south, from the west and from the east of this country. Parents of students of candidates and students or candidates themselves. Especially this period where there was a prolonged ASU strike. People want to know, is JPTS a university? They are curious. So today I want to address this question. By the way, JPTS stands for Joint Professional Training Support Institute. Is JPTS a university? Is it accredited by the NUC? Please, I want you to pay very close attention to this broadcast because it will help you and help us to stabilize our impression and everything we know about JPTS. Now, JPTS, as it operates its business of training candidates with the topmost educational training in Nigeria, is not a university. Rather, JPTS is an institute. Now, hold it a minute. Let me throw more light to this. Now, JPTS is an educational, a higher educational institute established in Nigeria, but that has affiliations to international universities like South American University in Costa Rica, South American University in the United States, Global West University in Togo, just to mention a few of the affiliations that we have. Now, these universities are accredited international universities that offer degree programs for BSc, Masters, PhD, even PGD. So what this means is that when you are enrolled into JPTS, you have the opportunity and the privilege to have options to pick at exemption any of these universities. So let's take for instance that you pick Global West University resident in Togo or South American University in Costa Rica. Let's say you pick one of these as your choice. So as you run through your degree program, whether in master's, in doctorate, or in your first degree, in whatever course, okay, let's zero down on media and mass communication for instance. If you are a media and mass communication student or candidate for instance, when you have done your entrance examination that qualified you to end the scholarship admission into JPTS, and as you run your program, if you pick South American University, Costa Rica, for instance, that becomes your parent university. So as you do your three years program with JPTS, at the end of your degree program, when you are graduating, it is this same university that you have picked at exception that will offer you your degree certificate. However, let me add that JPTS as the resident institution right here in Nigeria will also offer you its certificate. 
Don't also forget that JPTS is accredited by international standard organizations that oversees the running of higher institutions across the world. So this is what JPTS stands for. So JPTS is an institute. In fact, it is bigger than your conventional or traditional universities as it is known here. Now, as a student of this institute, you have an edge. What do I mean by this? By, by that you have an edge. The certificate that you are issued, your degree certificate that you are issued at the end of your studies gives you the advantage to secure jobs of your choice not only in Nigeria but outside of Nigeria. What this means is that with the certification that you receive from JPTS, you can work with those certificates anywhere in Nigeria and anywhere across the world. Those certificates can allow you to secure eminent jobs in Europe, in North America, in South America, in Asia, anywhere you want to work with those certificates. So today, I decided to address this question so that nobody will mislead you. Now, JPTS, as an educational institute, is registered with the Federal Ministry of Education, but not as a university. What this suggests is, if you go to the NUC website and you want to browse through the list of JPTS, you won't find the name of JPTS there because JPTS is not registered as a university in Nigeria. But JPTS is registered with the Federal Ministry of Education as a higher education platform that is affiliated to international universities. Now, listen to me and listen to me very well. JPTS offers a bigger platform for Nigerians to have access to higher education and our strategy is community higher institution strategy so that is why we have our presence in virtually all the six geopolitical zooms of Nigeria yes you heard me right the only places where JPTS is not operative or functional presently are those states where you have security unrest. It's not as if we don't have presence there. We have presence there. But our operations there currently are suspended because of the security unrest. You, If you are a Nigerian, you will be aware of the security unrest that are uh, present in certain parts of the country, both in the north and in the south. So, in those states where you have presence of security unrest, our operations are suspended there. So, but JPTS, as I speak right now, operates in the six geopolitical zones, 30 states or more presently. And I, Code John Efetobo, I am the admission processing officer approved and assigned to help you get express scholarship admissions into any of our institute wherever now let me add this by way of bonus information jpts institute has two kind of study centers we have what we call the weekdays centers 